I'm here with Jonathan Joss, and his project is called Chartered. So Jonathan, what was your role in this project? Uh, I play Jorge Herrera. He is a high school uh, Spanish teacher. Okay. And, uh, and encompasses uh, the day in the life of a, of a young student who's going to a new chartered school. Um, it's shot um, basically in, in, in like 2007, where the world wasn't as quite as crazy as it is now. Mm -hmm. uh, but it really embodies that first day at your new school. Right. This whole idea, you know, a fish out of water. Mm -hmm. um, kind of like a, a shot documentary style. So it's a lot similar to, very similar to Parks and Recreation, uh, which I've worked on as well. Um, but it was a really fun, fun project. Uh, small pilot, first time director, first time writer. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'm very excited to be a part of it. Great. So what was the genesis or the inspiration behind it? I think you touched on it just a little bit. Well, you know, I guess inspiration was I got a paycheck. <laughs> you know, and, that, and that's that's always a plus when you're an actor. Um, it was just to, to, to create something that's fun. Mm -hmm. Something that we all remember that first day at school. Um, and you, you know, meeting friends, uh, meeting the staff. Mm -hmm. um, and at the other side of that is that, you know, I, I taught school for a little bit. And it, it's also an experience when you're that teacher and it's your first day mm -hmm. of teaching high school. Um, so it's all about paying your dues uh, in, in the wonderful uh, high school years. Wow. So what kind of things did you learn while working on the set? Um, that it takes, of course, you know, you, you always realize it takes a lot of people mm -hmm. uh, to get a project up and running. Um, and this was a smaller project, very low budget. Mm -hmm. um, the great thing was that you had so many people backing it, so many people involved. Um, and it just learned to have fun. Yeah, absolutely. And how about the time frame of it? So from maybe, I'm not sure where you came in on this project, but do you recall uh, the time of where it was just in the idea to the point where you it was know, edited? Erin had talked to me about it, mm -hmm. um, I would say probably a year before. It was one of those projects where I forgot about it. Right. You know, my agent calls me and says, hey, you know, you've got this gig. Um, I remember I showed up on the first day of, uh, of uh, filming mm -hmm. and Aaron kind of hands me the script and there's a, some Spanish in there and I don't speak Spanish. Sure. And Aaron was like, well, but you told me you spoke Spanish. I said, well, I'll tell anybody anything <laughs> to get a job. You know, um, so we were able to take that concept of a Spanish teacher who really didn't speak Spanish. Um, <laughs> so uh, it, 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 for me, encompassed probably about a year, year and a half. Mm -hmm. um, we did this last year. Sure. So anytime you do anything in the film industry, it's like hurry up and wait. Right. Um, so you can view it on YouTube. You can go to Chartered and uh, and just throw some likes at us. Right. Um, the idea and the concept now is that hopefully someone finds it, mm -hmm. likes it, and kind of orders uh, more episodes. Right. So uh, it's in a short format right now? Uh, it's, uh, it's, it's 30 minutes. Oh, oh it is. Okay. Minutes. So it's, 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 it's a full pilot. It's a full pilot. Wonderful. Uh, with the, you know, the, the characters are being introduced uh, mm -hmm. and you, you're discovering you know more about where the teachers are coming from and where they're going. Um, I spoke to our director yesterday, Aaron, and he was already mentioning that he's already written a couple more episodes. Wonderful. Just in case. Oh, yeah. You That's, never know. Yeah, you, you got to have that in your back pocket for yeah, sure, especially when definitely. you're coming to a place like this and being seen. So. And what a great place. I mean, I've been to some film festivals, mm -hmm. uh, but never a, a festival especially you know, designed for this type of television right, and, exactly. and the streaming power. Mm -hmm. So it's, for me, this is a huge learning experience as well. It is, absolutely. And uh, so what's next for you? Man, um, some voiceover work, mm -hmm. a couple of video games uh, roaming around. That's right. Um, when we spoke the other day, you mentioned that you yeah. did some work on, with Sony or with yes, other... Yes, yeah, yeah. And I've got a little project coming up, hopefully. Nice. Um, it's all like non-disclosure, super hush-hush yes, okay. kind of stuff. We won't talk too um, much about it. Right, right. <laughs> um, but, you know, that's just hopefully going to end off the year. I, I was working in New York for a couple of months. I did Annie Get Your Gun, mm -hmm. a theatrical project, which I hadn't done theater in almost 20 years. Wow. So it was fun to go back and, and hang out with real actors. Right. You know, Can hang you out with people who have talent. about that? We were talking about it just the other night, how one actor kind of dropped a line and you were able to yeah, kind of respond didn't realize right could, yeah, away. I didn't realize that acting is, is not about acting, it's about responding. Mm -hmm. and, and so much of, of film is that you're usually there by yourself, just you and the camera. And sometimes the A-plus actor that you're opposite isn't even there. Mm -hmm. So to be able to take something on stage and, and be able to work through it every day. Right. For me, as an actor and as an artist, it, it proved that I still I can still do some things. Mm -hmm. You know, it's not about me wearing a, a, a breech cloth or falling off a horse. You know, <laughs> I can actually hit right. my mark when I needed it. That's wonderful. Well, good luck to you. Thank Welcome you. Welcome to Duluth. It's Thank been you. a pleasure getting to know I you love over the last Duluth. couple days. Oh, amazing. I just had uh, some Chinese food, uh, which... 
as you know the natural uh, you know the national food of, of Duluth, I think. <laughs> um, but I had a great time. So thank Wonderful. you very much for having me here, and uh, thank you guys. And if you get a chance, please go to Chartered and enjoy our show.